In this video, I want to go over the J and K strings problem on Code Wars. And what I want you to do is to convert strings to how they would be written by Jaden Smith. Smith. Basically, he is known for almost always capitalizing every word. So this um, this would be a string that they pass us. So let's look at the function. The string that they pass us is literally called string, and it would look like something like this. To turn it into Jaden K strings, we would just capitalize the first letter of every single word and we would return that. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to convert this string into a list with every word being an element. That way when I iterate throughout this new list that we create, every for every iteration, I will have access to the entire word rather than to a particular letter of that word, if that makes sense. So just make it easier for me to work with. So I'm gonna create a list called uh, list, and I'm gonna set it equal to string dot split what this split function does is it takes the string and what it does is it converts strings to lists and with the delimiter being uh, whatever you specify in here so if we did something like this the delimiter would be a period however if you don't specify anything the default delimiter would be white space now what it does is since the delimiter is white space in this case it is basically the separator between each unique element. So how would be one element or one item in our list? And then we hit the delimiter, which is white space, which separates the previous element to this element. And then can would be the second element and so on and so forth, if that makes sense. So now that we have this new list, we want to iterate throughout this list. And we're going to say... Actually, what we can actually do is we can use list comprehension, which would be much more succinct. So we're just going to create a list called new list. It's, and I'll explain it to you afterwards if you don't understand. But we're just going to say I dot capitalize um, for I in list. So what this is doing, the capitalize function, if you didn't already know, is it capitalizes the very first letter of any word that you uh, basically so I would be a unique word in the string that they provide us what capitalize would do is it would take the first letter convert it into an uppercase letter then every letter thereafter would be converted to a lowercase letter aka a Jaden case string and since we're using a for loop we're just iterating throughout every single element in the list and for every single element we're capitalizing it into a Jaden case string and then we're appending it to our new list by just putting it right here. At the end of it, we're going to have a list. So if we just return, first of all, we're going to print new list. And I'll show you what we're going to have to do after this. So new list. And then we're going to return new list. This won't be correct because although the words will be correct, they will be actually in a list and we need it in a string but let's attempt it I don't think any of them will pass yeah so most trees are blue that is correct this is Jaden case the first letter is capitalized every subsequent letter is lowercase but it should equal most trees are blue a string the way we can convert uh, strings or the way we can convert lists back into strings, the opposite of what we did with the split function, is we have a join function. Dot join new list. Now what this does is basically the reverse. This join function will take whatever you provide here. In this case, a lit the list that we just converted into a Jaden case string. Um, and it puts the elements in that list together with Whatever uh, you put in here, whether it be white space or nothing, whatever you put in here to be the uh, what puts them together. So if you have no space, this is what's going to be between every single element. And if we attempt it, you'll see it just puts them all together. Most trees are blue because it took every single element, put them together with this in between. Say we did a star, it'll be a star between every single element. Uh, most star tree star are blue. As you can see, I went on a tangent. Sorry for making the video longer, but we just need a, a, a blank space. And th there you go. 124 test cases passed. 
That was the Jaden K. Strings problem on Code Wars. Uh, I hope that you learned something. And if you did, I would appreciate if you liked, commented, and subscribed. And I will see you guys in future tutorials.